In this video, we'll learn how to manage all the tasks we have to do with the Joomla default menu manager by only using JSN Power Admin 2. In the components menu item, go to JSN Power Admin 2 and click on Site Manager. This is the JSN Power Admin 2 Site Manager page. Here we can do any task to manage menu and menu items. First is the eye icon, which allows you to toggle invisible menu items. Click on this icon to show or hide unpublished and deleted menu items. Click on the down arrow icon to show the list of menus on your website and select a menu to manage. When a menu is selected, the contents and modules of that menu will be shown on the component and module section. And here, click on the Add New Menu function to be redirected to the Menus Add page to create a new menu. Let's try to create a JSN Power Admin 2 menu as an example. Don't forget to hit Save and go back to the Site Manager page to check. As you can see, a JSN Power Admin 2 menu has been created. Next to the down arrow icon is the pencil icon. Click here and select Edit Function to be redirected to the menu editing page. Next is Rebuild. This function is based on the Joomla default Rebuild menu function. It allows you to recreate the path of each menu item based on its alias, as well as the path of its parent item. Also, it fixes the LFT and RGT fields on your website. Next is the More item. It allows you to delete the menu and go to the Menus Options page. Let's try to select the User menu to delete. Click on the Delete function and Confirm. Go back to check the list of menus and the user menu that was deleted. Go to the Menus Options page quickly with one click to the Options function. The next one is the Add Menu Item function. It will redirect you to the Menus New Item page where you can create a new menu item. Let's try to create a URL menu item as an example. Select a parent item if you need. Don't forget to save the menu. Go back to the Site Manager page to view the new menu item that was just created. Next, we will explore the Menu Item Manager. First is Select Function. It shows the content of the component assigned to the menu item in the component area and all the modules on the page that is selected. The Edit function will redirect you to the Menu Edit Item page to edit a menu item that was created before. Click on the Unpublish function to unpublish the menu item. To show and publish an item, click on the eye icon on the top of the menu box to show all the unpublished items. The next one is the Rebuild function. It allows you to recreate the path of each menu item based on its alias as well as the path of its parent item. With the More option, you can select the Set as Home function. It allows you to select a menu item to show content on the home page. Next is the Trash function. It allows you to move the menu item to the trash. To publish the item that was trashed again, click on the eye icon and publish that item.
The load custom assets function enables you to add CSS or JavaScript files. To show this function on the Site Manager page, we need to go to the JSN Power Admin 2 settings page. Click on the Site Manager tab and select Yes to enable this function. Next is the Expand All. This function allows you to expand the menu and show all the sub-menu items. Otherwise, to collapse all sub-menu items, select the Collapse All function. The next one is the Add Menu Item function. It will redirect you to the Menu's New Item page where you can create a new menu item. The last feature of the Menu Manager section is the Sort and Move a Menu Item. This function helps you sort the order of items by dragging and dropping. All the functions of the Menu and Menu Item Manager have been displayed. Thank you for watching. Please check our other videos to learn more about how to work with JSN Power Admin 2.